So we are on our way to the mall to do a little bit of Christmas shopping. So this is kind of going to be a day in our life. And then later on when it gets dark, I'll show you Connor's Christmas lights that are so beautiful and amazing and the little details that he did. So stay tuned. Um, we're going to do some shopping our favorite things and <laughs> one of Connor's favorite things and something I'm just trying to enjoy so <laughs> we're just gonna go to kind of a day in the life today so stay tuned and so I'm sitting in the change room um, at Torrid and having some major body dysmorphia because everything is a smaller size and I haven't been a smaller size for so long so trying on bras everything's way smaller trying on like two sizes smaller has been crazy and I hate hated trying on clothes before because it was embarrassing and having to ask for bigger sizes and all that kind of stuff and now i'm in smaller sizes and i'm struggling with the way i look because i still think of myself as 700 pounds and not 450 pounds down so it's a struggle and it's real and as much as i you know exude this confidence online and all this kind of stuff i still am super struggling with body dysmorphia even you know I've done like a body comp building competition. I've done all these different things. I'm on social media and I still have this like shaken confidence when it comes to trying on clothes. So today was a big day that I tried on clothes and everything was smaller and I just accepted myself for where I'm at and it was a breakthrough. So we are stopping for lunch at Carl's Jr. I got some chicken strips and fries. Connor got a big ass burger. We've never been here before, so we wanted to try it. And we just have some time to kill before we go get the kids. So we did some shopping, got some stuff, uh, stuff I needed, like bras and stuff like that, underwear, all stuff that doesn't fit me anymore. Now we're having, I'm having some chicken strips and some fries. Pretty good. Mm -hmm. How's your burger? I haven't tried it yet. Oh. But what I did want to say was that a lot of people won't go to a fast food restaurant or whatever because they're not paying attention to what they're eating. Yeah. So why is this something that you can just do whatever you feel? So I, I do a flexible dieting approach. So I can eat this type of thing because I track it and I know how much is in my calories and macros to a lot for this type of thing. Now it's not an everyday thing, but it's something that I can enjoy and not feel guilty about. Yeah, it's track my fitness on. So it's tracked. It's enjoyed every bite. I don't feel guilt or shame around food anymore because I've healed most of my relationship with it. And because I work with Don, you know, he also like coaxed me through like the whole not eating carbs and eating bad for eating foods and stuff like that. So yeah, I can enjoy this and feel great. And so most of the time, big ass bite. <laughs> most of the time I don't actually finish it. I will take it home or Connor will finish it or I'll give it to the kids. Those are my macros. <laughs> so I fuck up Connor's macros because I can't finish anything. Mm. Um, <laughs> I'm always good. So yeah, we're just gonna have some lunch, go get the kiddos, and then we have to go back out again. So I'll take you on the rest of my day. Jesus Christ. <laughs> So we just it looks went. Like you've been in a crash. iPhone will trigger emergency SOS if you don't respond. <laughs> what was that? Oh my god! My phone thinks we were just in a head-on collision. Apparently. What the? Okay. So, <laughs> this is our life right now. Leave that in. <laughs> So we just went to Shoppers Drug Mart mm -hmm. and we went to go buy stocking stuffers. Yep. That was so underwhelming. Even yeah. the mall was underwhelming. Yeah. We shop online all the time, so we you never really go to stores. And when we went to the stores, we were just like, oh, mm -hmm. this isn't great. No. <laughs> we could have bought this online, this online. Like, yeah, yeah it's just so different no. now. Nobody seemed to care that we were there. That service wasn't good. <laughs> the service was good. <laughs> yeah, we're yeah. just so Fun. used to a certain standard and it's just not there anymore and yeah so we will be shopping more online mm -hmm. and we have for the last three years done amazon christmas mm -hmm. so where everything came from amazon so i'm going back to amazon because mm -hmm. i prefer all that stuff that usually comes from there and mm -hmm. it's usually good and it's an easy return process if you don't like it so we're gonna be doing that for stocking stuffers because everything we got that we looked at sucked um and i'm not just filling my kids stockings with just chocolate that's just not 
a thing. So we're waiting for the roommates to get out of school. They're going to come. We're gonna drop them off. And then we are going to Potter's, which is the Christmas store, because we're getting a special gift there. Mm -hmm. So we're super excited to go there because it's amazing and I'll sure. do a little. I'm super excited to go there. So once we go there, I'll sh I'll put in a little bit of a video in there. It's, it's how many times have we been here so far? There. <laughs> Just stop. <laughs> okay. So I'll I'll insert the video. But yeah. And then when it gets dark, I'll show you Connor's magical Christmas lights. Mm -hmm. They're beautiful. Okay, so we're at Potter's and we're in the Christmas store and literally they have so much stuff. We're just at the beginning of the store. We haven't even got to the edges of the store or even towards the end yet. Here are Connor's beautiful lights, all symmetrical. He also did the outside of the door, which those lights aren't on. And then put, we put some little trees there. And so that's a wrap on my day. I now have a bombshell call that I'm gonna get done. And then that's it. Dinner is just going to be a sandwich tonight because I'm exhausted. And yeah, so like and subscribe and I will talk to you guys in the next one.